Hey guys, Wood Craftsman here. Just a quick tour of some custom cabinets in the shop here. It's actually just a uh, L-shape wet bar for our customer's basement that they finished off. So it's real simple. Uh, it's got a sink on this end here, two functional drawers, a drawer on top of the blind corner, and then um, in this cabinet here, there is a recycling center and some pull-out shelves or pull-out drawers, trays or call them. This is a shop-built pull-out. It's actually a dovetail drawer box with a frame glued to the top of it and the opening fits the garbage can and it's a soft close. Pull-out uh, drawers here are pull-outs and these are actually adjustable. These are five millimeter holes and actually use the five millimeter posi screws. So these literally can be adjusted by the customer wherever they want to move these or maybe they want to add one they can do that <clears throat> just a couple drawers on top here blue motion soft close the uh, bottom here just has a shelf in this blind corner it's kind of useless and there's not a lot to do with it because this cabinet is so shallow it's eight inches from the front to the back and uh, Soft maple dovetail drawers, half blind dovetail, four and a quarter inches high, uh, quarter inch maple bottom, fully concealed bottom. You can see here the notches cut for the uh, Bloom Motion drawer slides. These drawer slides are actually the Bloom 563F series for a three quarter inch thick drawer box. And the drawer front is held in place with the drawer front uh, mounting adjusting screws. They're, uh, inch and a quarter long and they're a coarse thread with a self-tapping head with a washer head at the very end so I actually drill a 5 16 hole and I can move this drawer from around as much as I need to which is pretty rare so going to the back here we have a full raised panel back so the wall is right here and there's plumbing that comes out so these raised panels actually wrap around to the other side. So here's the back side or the side that you'd be uh, served to. The bartending side. Raised panel end that wraps around into this raised panel end, which wraps around into that raised panel end. So this has already been pre-fit uh, flush trimmed and sanded so that way when this gets screwed together on site this here will be perfectly flush with this here so this edge butts into here so this will be a perfect seam once brought out to the site the doors are misaligned right now because the concrete in the shop here is so uneven that it really messes with the openings so I won't bother adjusting them until uh, this actually gets out in the field so Hopefully deliver this the next day or two. We're talking quite a bit of snow here, so um, we'll see. All right, guys, just thought I'd share this with you. Just saw a quick, kind of a quick update on this. Um, I didn't get a whole lot on the build on this. I got part of the panel raising for the raised panel doors. I got the outside edge profile video, the hinge boring video, and then the um, finishing video of spraying the vinyl sealer and the pre-cat lacquer on this order. So. And this actually was a color match. So this is the piece of trim that they gave us to match. And as you can see here, looks real well. The lighting's not the best in this area for it, but kind of get the picture. So yeah. Anyways, uh, hope you guys enjoyed this quick cabinet tour and uh, hopefully I'll have some more videos of some other projects coming up. Alright guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Questions and positive comments are welcome. Alright guys, thanks for watching.